Hey guys, I'm Sam with Mattress Makers and this is another episode of Anatomy of a Mattress. Hey guys, so today we're gonna open up the Tempur-Pedic Cloud Lux mattress. And just to let you guys know, the whole point of these uh, videos, the Anatomy of a Mattress, is just to take away the mystery of what's inside mattresses. Something that you sleep on and use every single day, but you don't know what's going on the inside. You're kind of just taking it for face value of the salesman. And we thought we'd just show you how mattress is made. Um, it's also to educate you on what to look for, uh, what's, what are the right questions to ask when you're shopping for a new mattress. So you get a mattress that's not only comfortable, but it's gonna be comfortable for a long time. So that's the whole point of these videos. And if you're in the market for a new mattress, come by, and you're in San Diego, come by uh, Mattress Makers. We have a store in Miramar and a store in La Mesa, and you can try them all out. We have uh, our mattresses, a lot of them are with zipper covers, so we can open it up and show, them, show you what's on the inside. And we wanna educate you first, so you make an informed decision. Um, if you're just starting, not ready to step into the store, just download our free mattress shopping guide. The link's in the description. It's gonna give you some tips on what to look for, um, mistakes to avoid when mattress shopping. So those are the, the things you wanna look for. And uh, So download our, our free shopping guide. It's the link's in the description and uh, hopefully it'll help you out. So let's open up this Tempur-Pedic Cloud Lux. Customer, we got this uh, from a customer. We picked it up, their old mattress when we replaced it with their, our new one. Um, you know, they said it was softening up, starting to dip in certain areas. And so I looked at the data manufacturing. This was made in 2012. So it's a seven year old um, Tempur-Pedic mattress, which about seven years is what we see the average mattress lasting. Uh, hopefully we get more out of it. Uh, you, you know, the, having the right materials is gonna help you extend that life. Um, this retail, I don't know what at the time it retails, but the same model, like the newer model, is retailing uh, for about 2700 in a queen size. Okay, so let's take a look and see what that gets you. One thing I like about Tempur-Pedic is they had a, they always put a zipper, which makes it nice. That's a nice feature to have. So you can just take, open it right up. So first things first, this is the FR sock or fire retardant sock. Uh, every mattress manufacturer in the US needs to pass a fire retardant test. Doesn't mean it needs to be chemicals, but it does need to pass the test. So this is how the Tempur-Pedic does, does it. Let's cut this open so we can see what's on the inside. All right, so when we open up a mattress and what we're looking at, we always wanna start with the three things that's inside mattresses that we're looking at. So the first thing is the support layer. Support layers typically gonna be firmer than the rest of the layers. And the reason for that is it's what's supporting the whole mattress, usually at the bottom of it to support your back. On top of that is gonna be the comfort layer. Comfort layer is gonna be uh, where you get most of that pressure relief shoulders and hips for side sleepers. Um, usually a little bit softer, so you, you need some pressure relief. And then on top of that is the cover. You know, the cover is what you see when you look at the mattress. Usually gonna affect the uh, temperature, uh, breathability of it, main factor of it. Uh, a little bit of the comfort as well if it's quilted. So in this Tempur-Pedic, this is the support layer here. So it looks like you have two layers of convoluted foam, polyurethane foam each one being about, on the high end, about three and a half inches. So you got about, maybe four inches, about eight inches of just support layer. These two guys here, you know, the convoluted foam is a kind of a popular um, uh, poly foam or foam to use in mattresses. They talk about the peaks and the valleys of how to distribute that weight. Um, you know, it's, it's unfortunately, we're not big fans of it. Doesn't mean it's a bad one. It's just our philosophy is not not the best. You know, you, you're losing a lot of uh, material in those in those valleys there, and it doesn't tend to hold up over a long period of time. So, nonetheless, it's that's, they use it there. Some some companies really like it. Um, 
us not too much of a fan. And then on top of that is two layers of the comfort layer. This is their temper foam, which essentially is just memory foam. Um, it looks like the top one, pretty soft here with the, the middle layer, the transitional layer, a little bit firmer. Uh, now with memory foam or any foam, they, how they measure uh, kind of the durability is a lot by density. And so they'll weigh, weigh in a cubic block and they'll weigh the, the foam. So in memory foam, you know, the, the higher the, the density, usually the firmer it is. So this looks, feels maybe about a three pound density, which means it's not bad, but it's, it's because it's softer at three pounds, you're probably gonna, it's probably gonna break down a little quicker. This one feels maybe about a, maybe six pound here. Hard to really judge, but because it's a little bit firmer, you kind of feel it's gonna last a little bit longer than this here. So this is really, if in any mattress is you want to pay attention to the, the first layer and the comfort layer. This is where it's probably going to break down and probably, I mean, look at it, this is where it did break down. So, um, but it's just a mattress full of foam inside it. Um, not necessarily bad mattress, you know, Tempur-Pedic, um, you know, they're a big company. They make what a lot of people like comfortable, say this comfortable mattress. So, you know, when it comes to mattress, comfort is key but we want to make sure that comfort lasts a long time. And so you want to get the most for your money. Um, what, what, we, what I would like to see done here and what we've done in our mattress, so something that's comparable to this would be like our Lucadia or a Cardiff mattress, which has you know that memory foam inside of it. It's, um, it's gonna be, we use a higher density memory foam, so it does last a long time. But what makes things a little bit different than us, uh, from uh, us compared to them is, we'll make it double-sided. So you have another layer underneath that. So when that top layer starts to get softer, right then you can flip it, it's gonna you know, double the, the life of your mattress. You know, how mattresses used to be made. So, you know, for 2,700 bucks, you know, you, you're, a lot of you paying for the name, not, but it's not a bad bed. You know, if, you, if you're looking in the market for, uh, uh, you like that Tempur-Pedic feel, you like the memory foam feel, stop by one of our stars, stores, check out the Lucadia, the Cardiff, uh, we reach out $12.99 and it's a double-sided uh, memory foam bed. Uh, we make all of our mattresses. We're local, uh, family-owned. Uh, so come by and if you guys are in the market for a new mattress, check out the our mattress shopping guide and love to help you out. If you have any questions, re uh, leave them in the comments or you can call us or send us an email. We'd love to help you out. So this is the Tempur-Pedia Cloud Lux. See you guys next time. Oh, 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 oh,